Oh, storage crates. Oh boy. Oh, now I'm drunk. Oh God. Oh God. It is too early on a Saturday to be drunk. All right. A Seabad production. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to one of my the one one of my favorite games I've ever had the pleasure to play, Bioshock. This is remastered on PC. If you guys want to check it out, I definitely recommend you guys. If you guys have never played this game, if you guys think, "Wow, I don't want to watch this guy commentate over this," pick up the game for yourself. This is if I had to make a list of top five games anybody should play. This is on that game. It's a fantastic game. If you guys are new. Hi, my name is Chase. We are here on Seabad at Gaming. And if you guys are old, welcome out. And if you guys are excited, feel free to leave a like on the video. If you guys are ready for a brand new adventure, I'm going to try my best not to like spoil things as we go through because I want those of you who have never seen this gameplay to have just as, as pure of a reaction as I did the first time I played it. But we are going to start off a brand new game here. We're going to adjust the brightness. Until the dark gray box is just barely visible against the gray background. I don't see any change. Which dark gray box? The one underneath the gameplay? I don't see any changes. So I'm going to leave it as is. Until. And we are going to play on medium difficulty. Because that's always fun. Gives myself a challenge. But it's not like super cringy. Like, like I have to sit there and just like go silent while I try out. But... This game is absolutely fantastic. Um, this came out, I believe, on the original Xbox 360. It was one of the launch titles or one of the few titles that came out afterwards. And just took my breath away. Took my breath away. And if, the, if you guys like this, then there is a there is a franchise. There is a sequel and then another game as well. But we are, uh, it is the year 1960 and we are over the mid-Atlantic. They told me, son, you're special. You were born to do great things. You know what? They were right. I guess we're gonna crash over the mid-Atlantic to start things off here. We didn't even get to open our birthday present. It asked us, would you kindly not open this until, and we don't know when we were supposed to open it yet. So sad, right out of the gate. But, like I said, fantastic game. Let's surface from under the water here. We're just getting thrown right into it. We're going to try to keep these episodes a little bit... I want to say longer. Oh, God. Look at all these people. That was an airplane propeller that almost took my head off. Oh, God. Oh, jeez. The whole plane crashed. Good thing I'm here. What happened to our plane? Jeez Louise. Alright. Alright, well let's try to swim. There's a there's a building we can go try to swim to. Let's go do that. Um, but these episodes are gonna I'm gonna try to aim for these to be a little bit longer. Probably airing on the side of 30 plus minutes each, because this is one of those story-based games where you just like to have as much of it in one sitting as possible. I don't think I could just sit down for 20 minutes and they're like, okay, I'm done. Like, it's hard for me to sit down just for 30 minutes at a time and say, here we go. But we're going to do our best to, to play this game. And like I said, if you guys like it, there is a sequel and there is a um, there's Bioshock 2. And then there's also uh, the Bioshock. Um, oh, it's the future one. I can't think of the name right now. I can't think of the name right now. Infinite. I actually have never played Infinite. So that'd be a fun experience to have on here as well. If you guys like it. There is. We're, okay. We're in the middle of the Atlantic Ocean. It is the year 1960. Like, we've got technology, but, like, technology's, like, still, like, compared to today, that that's, that, that's 60 years ago. And there's just this giant tower in the middle of the Atlantic Ocean with, like, golden doors? I don't know. Seems kind of fishy to me, man. Seems kind of fishy to me, man. Hello? No gods or kings, only man. Well then. 
Well then. I love the soundtrack in this game, by the way. I hope you guys like like music like this. I love the soundtrack in this game. Look at the artwork. Like the sun spearing the fish and the waves, and it's like opening the sea. All right. Ooh. Got a little submarine here, it looks like. Well, hey, you know, we just showed up in the middle of the ocean. Our plane crashed. We seem rather calm. Let's get in this bathosphere and see what we've got going on. Let's just go deeper into the water now. Ten fathoms. I love the artwork in this, man. I love the artwork. Eighteen fathoms. I don't know how long a fathom is or how deep a fathom is. Oh, there's a movie. Oh, cool. Fire at your fingertips. Incinerate. Plasmids by Ryan Industries. I am Andrew Ryan, and I'm here to ask you a question. Is a man not entitled to the sweat of his brow? No, says the man in Washington. It belongs to the poor. No, says the man in the Vatican. It belongs to God. No, says the man in Moscow. It belongs to everyone. I rejected those answers. Instead, I chose something different. I chose the impossible. I chose rapture. Welcome to Rapture, ladies and gentlemen. City where the artist would not be in the censor. Looking for captions really quickly. There we go. Scientists would not be bound by petty morality, where the great would not be constrained by the small. And with the sweat. Captions? Dialogue subtitles should be there. Oh, maybe it's because we're in the middle of a cutscene. Okay, never mind. Never mind. Sorry. Your brow, rapture can become your city as well. I love it, man. Like the font, the neon. Oh my god! And there's just a whale swimming through rapture, this underground paradise. We're getting like a radio transmission. All good things of this earth flow into the city. Mmm. Mmm. Oh, I love it. I love it so much. <laughs> it's so good. Oh, I hope you guys enjoy this game as much as I do. Welcome to Rapture, ladies and gentlemen. Oh my god, it has been so long since I've played this game. I think the last time, I think I tried playing through this game on Twitch probably a year ago at this point. Um, we didn't get too far, so it's been over a year since it, I've had any immersion back into this game. So, we are going to have... We are going to have some pretty gener re generous and, and genuine reactions here. Uh oh. Oh! Oh God! Is it someone new? No. Oh god. I'm trying to get in? No no no. No no no. No 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 no. Nope. Nope. Get, can I can I not leave? Oh god. Well, looks like I'm stuck here now. Would you kindly take 
There's a radio in here? There is a radio. I don't know how you survived that plane crash, but I've never been one to question Providence. I'm Atlas, and I aim to keep you alive. Now keep on moving. We're gonna have to get you to higher ground. Okay. New goal, get to higher ground. Okay, we can do that. Well, gee, thanks. Uh, what about your buddy that you left twisting in the wind, huh? We're gonna need to draw her out of hiding, but you're gonna have to trust me. Vita chamber. We'll get we'll get training eventually. The reason I point that out, Vita chambers. If you die, you respawn at Vita chambers. There is a hard difficulty on here where if you die, there's no Vita chamber access. So you just restart the whole game. Ooh. ooh. Please don't. Please don't wrap me in a sheet. Oh, God. Oh. Okay. All right. Just a bit border. How do you like that, Oh, geez. Okay. All right. Well, good thing there's a wrench right here. Let's get clear all this debris out of the way. Oh, God. All right. Oh, no. Oh, no. Ah! 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 Woo. Okay. He's got... Eve hypo and a first aid kit. You got a first aid kit. Press B to use it to heal. I'm okay right now. I didn't take that much damage. All right. Door control seems to be locked. Let's keep... We need to hit higher ground. Rapture, November 5th, 1946. One man's vision, mankind's salvation. Oh, boy. No kings or gods, only men. Alright, Gatherer's Garden. Electro Bolt. Okay. We're just gonna inject that right into the veins there. We're gonna inject that right into the veins. Oh boy. I think I tried to kill myself. This little fish looks like he just had his cherry popped. Wonder if he's still got some Adam on him. Please don't. Ooh, the big daddy. No better off with a metal daddy, little fish. See you floating, my No, thank you. I'm okay. I do not want to float. Thank you. I would like to figure out where the hell I am. Ooh, big daddy. Hey, big daddy. Look at that drill. Look, Mr. Bubbles. It's an angel. I can see light coming from his belly. All right. Wait a minute. He's still breathing. It's all right. I know he'll be an angel soon. Well, that's mean of you. I will not be an angel soon. I'm trying to escape. I have a birthday present somewhere at the bottom of the Mid-Atlantic to open. I want my birthday present. You all right, boy? First time plasma is a real kick from a mule. But there's nothing like a fistful of lightning now, is there? All right, pull left trigger to use plasmid. Yeet. Look at that. Now we can shoot lightning. Ah, ah. Oh, God. Oh, there's a... There's a part of the plane that I flew in on. Is my birthday present in here? Please. We should probably try running. 
I don't know if I can run. Oh boy, yeah, we need to get in here. We need to get in here. Anything around here worth picking up? An Eve Hypo, cool. Nothing in the ashtray. There's another Vita Chamber, so yeah, they're- yeah. One, two, punch. Hey, you look like you're standing in some water, bud. Oh, God. There we go. Yeah. One, two, punch. Thank you. I thought standing in the water would have done the trick here. Didn't think. Oh, what do you got for me, junkie? First aid kit and some Eve hypo. And... We just drank some wine, so we gained health but lost Eve. Okay. So the blue bar is our Eve. The blue bar is our Eve. The red bar is our health. Oh, that didn't. Okay. Well. Oh, God. All right. He was, oof, he was not friendly. I mean, any guy coming at you in an elevator on fire might not be friendly. Um, so you came from there. That's the highest ground. That one's out of order. All of those seem to be out of order. We'll go in this precariously open elevator and see what happens. Nothing bad can happen when you go in a scary elevator. All right, I guess we have to find this guy's family. Go to Neptune's Bounty. Follow the compass to your arrow goal. All right, there's a Vita Chamber. Some first aid. Somebody, like, right here. Somebody's singing. And here's a loving memory. Where? Oh, she's right here. There we go. Oh. Plasma's changed everything. They destroyed Done. our bodies, our minds. We couldn't handle it. Best friends butchering one another. Babies strangled in cribs. The whole city went to hell. Oh, Jesus. That doesn't sound like fun. Happy New Year, 1959. Oh, boy. Well, let's try to find... Whiskey restores our health but reduces our you. That's not what I want. Uh, yeah, I'm going to let you survive for a little bit. Got a lot of health kits. There's a news vendor. Is there somebody in here? There's somebody in here. <clears throat> hey Brenda, you care to tell me why you had a hole in the wall the size of Plymouth Rock coming out of your crapper going on three weeks now? Now I ain't saying I'm Shakespeare. I'm trying to run a respectable theater. I got working folk coming in from Port Neptune trying to catch a little diversion. And all they can think about is the stink coming out of your shitter. Get it fixed. All right. So there's a hole in the bathroom somewhere. Anything in any of these sinks that we can use? Maybe it's in the men's bathroom? Oh, there is. It's a gigantic hole. Are you kidding me? I do. Don't be fooled. She's a little sister now. Somebody went and turned a sweet baby girl into a 
Let's go get a closer look. Whatever you thought about right and wrong on the surface, well, that don't count for much down in Rock. Oh, boy. Those little sisters, they carry Adam. The genetic material that keeps the wheels of Rapture turning. Everybody wants us, everybody needs us. That's horrifying. Oh, boy. Well, they carry the they carry the genetic code that everybody wants here. Oh God! Uh oh, becomes Big Daddy. Becomes Big Daddy. Oh my God! Oh! Okay. Oh boy. Well then, we'll get his pistol rounds, and I think I have to shoot the lock. Press start to save your game. Okay, we'll save. There we go. All right. Boy, we really just get... They really just put you in it right here. We need as much ammunition as we can get. Let's scavenge around. Let's scavenge around and see what we can get. Ooh, we got a cream cake. I've got... Oh, Vita Chamber. Thank you. Blessed be the Vita Chamber. Oh, God. Oh, uh, okay. Don't you disrespect Oh, you're tough. You are tough. You did not just get one shot. Why did everybody else get zapped? Alright. Got another Eve hypo. Alright. Well, let's be careful because I think there's one more around here. There we go. Yeet. Two for one. Oh, I'm not immune to my own electricity. I was like, yeah. Broken mechanics. All right. There's a corpse here. Big dandy corpse. Ooh, 33 bucks. I like it. So the gist behind the big dandy corpse is that they typically are like mini loot boxes. They'll usually have a lot of stuff on there. Oh, Neptune's bounty is over there. Good morning, Rapture. Wonderful. Good morning, Rapture. What's up that way? The medical pavilion. Medical. Oh, there's more bathroom stuff. Let's go dig around really quickly. Sometimes there is... Like, look at that. We got bandages for our health. Um, Anything in any of the sinks? Sometimes you got to look everywhere just to get everything. This early game, we won't need a lot of these med kits. But late game, it's going to be a must-have. So there is the guy's bathroom. The women's bathroom, like, over here. Oh, storage crates. Oh, boy. Oh, now I'm drunk. Oh, God. Oh, God. It is too early on a Saturday to be drunk. All right. And we got $3. All right. Well, let us make our way... Oh no, security alert and poggers. Oh shit, ow! Headshot, headshot, double up, boom, look at that. Call it a triple kill. All right, all right. You had nothing on you? Just blew up, oh, more of you? Come on down. One down in the water. Come on, Andrew Ryan. Oh, we have to go to medical? Okay. Let me search all the spikers real quick. 
Let me search all these splicers real quick. All right, now we have to go to medical now that he found us, now that there's security lockdown. But I cannot run. We're gonna try to make our way through medical right now. Let me just reload real quick. Oh boy, oh God. Oh boy. This isn't good. I'm just trying to help out this man's family. All right. So tell me, friend, which one of the bitches sent you? The KGB wolf or the CIA jackal? Here's the news. Rapture isn't some sunken ship for you to plunder. And Andrew Ryan isn't a giddy socialite who be slapped around by government muscle. Okay. So he thinks I'm like trying to infiltrate his his paradise, but that is certainly not the case. Oh god, I'm gonna zap you all. All right, let's go to the medical pavilion quick. I'm glad he can override that security. That's a helpful ally to have. Aim for the head, you'll do more damage. Is that so? Will I really do more damage? Is that a big hair in my beard? Oh boy. Oh boy. I don't know how that fuzz got there. Well, now we need to figure out a way to get back to Neptune's bounty to help out our friend Atlas. We got the Vita Chamber here. Here you go. Restore vigor and spirit with the touch of a button. Oh, I accidentally used a first aid kit when I didn't need to. With Adam, there's no reason not to be beautiful. Dr. Steinman's cosmetic enhancements. All right. A vending machine. All right. Well, let's purchase one more of those. I'll purchase some more pistol rounds as well. I can hack a security bot? Okay, well, let's try to do... Let's try to hack the security bot really quickly. Revealing tiles. Find pipe segments by revealing hidden tiles. Pick up pipes and slot them with other pipes to create a connected line. Make a chain to the exit pipe. Guide the flow of metallic liquid to the exit pipe. This new circuit will rewire the mechanics for the desired effects. All right, so we need to do something like this. And then I need one of these. And then I need, like... The top elbow. Come on, there it is. Perfect. All right. Connect the product. Boom. There we go. Hack security bots are friendly and will attack your enemies. All right, and now we're in a security inventory, so we can probably check out some of the stuff over here. Oh, we're here in emergency access. All right. There's one. Headshots. Headshots make the world go round. Bandages. First aid kit. Oh, we've got enough first aid kit. Adam's changes. His new diary update. Ryan and Adam. Adam and Ryan. All those years of study. And was I ever truly a surgeon before I met them? How we plinked away with our scalpels and toy morality. Yes. We could lop a boil here and shave down a beak there, but but could we really change anything? Shave down a beak? No. What type of people were they experimenting on? Gives us the means to do it. And Ryan frees us from the phony ethics that held us back. Change your look, change your sex, change your race. It's yours to change. Nobody else's. Oh, jeez. So with this Adam stuff that they're going after, you could you could get everything. Got some more pistol rounds here. There's emergency access. I thought I heard the twinkling sound coming from up here. Yeah, there it is. Oh boy. I don't want to know what's in there. Let's use the emergency access control. Oh boy. Oh god, would you know it? Oh, 
Alright. We have to go find Dr. Steinman now. He was the one... So Dr. Steinman was the one that just... We were just hearing about on the recording. So we have to go find him to get the emergency access into Neptune's bounty. And frankly, I think this is as good a place as any to wrap things up. So I hope you guys have enjoyed the first episode of Bioshock. I am so excited to be playing through this game with you guys. If you guys have enjoyed, let me know your guys' thoughts in the comments section. And of course, if you guys are new, feel free to subscribe for more so you do not miss out. All that being said, I want to remind you guys to be great and do great. And I'll see you all in the next video. Later.